What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Tats and today I'd like to share a story of a vacation that I took to Jervis Bay and some pictures that I took along the way. After a fairly quick drive, we made it to the first of many beaches that we would visit this trip, Cave Beach. Cave Beach isn't the typical beach that you would visit when coming here. Most of the beaches in Jervis Bay have warmer water because they are in the bay. However, Cave Beach is actually open to the ocean, so it's much colder. We relaxed here for a while and we just swam around and I took pictures with Minji's Nikon L35 AD point and shoot film camera. Minji also shot with her Minolta point and shoot film camera but the sad reality unfortunately we realized later on that there was actually no film in her film camera. After our swim we got fresh at our Airbnb and headed out for some dinner before the sunset. The light was just beautiful, it was sunset time and just we decided to go for a walk around the town area and came across this rock pool and yeah honestly i came across like a dream picture of mine i think the picture of the pool ladder is like it's such a photographer cliche, especially like a film photographer cliche. But you know, I haven't taken this photo before, so... Not too cold nor windy, it was quite a pleasant morning at the beach. There was a couple of other people on the beach with us and we just sat down and waited for the sun to rise. Because of the low light conditions at this time of the day, I had to shoot with my aperture wide open at f2.8. Honestly, when I shoot at f2.8 with this camera, I find it very hard to focus accurately. I was actually pleasantly surprised when I got these images back because, man, everything looks so sharp and beautiful. So as the day moved on, the weather was actually turning for the worse and a storm was actually starting to come in. There was still a couple of hours before the storm would hit, so we decided to head to a new beach that we'd never been to called Long Beach South. Long Beach South is on the other side of the bay and the landscape immediately took our breaths away as we stepped out of the car. The stormy blue sky complemented the muted tones of the water and sand and, and honestly, I just knew that there was going to be some banging images to take. I really enjoyed this portrait of Minji as well. The colors are very cinematic almost with the water being slightly green and the depth of field focusing on her earring and her hair while making everything else just buttery smooth and blurred out. I don't think I'll ever get sick of how film really just blurs out the background so buttery smooth. Overnight the storm came in and went away, leaving us with some great weather the next day. We decided to go to one of the more popular sites of Jervis Bay and headed to a beach called Greenfield Beach.
after swimming and sun baking all day it was unfortunately time for us to end our trip so we got some food and headed home i think it's very important for us to try and find and make time for ourselves just to relax and you know recuperate from our very busy lives anyway on that note i will see you next time thank you for watching this video and yeah if you haven't subscribed to my channel consider it okay bye